Dr. Kathleen Feicht, and in this video segment, we'll talk about basic taste perceptions. Early on, sensory science described four basic taste perceptions that register on the tongue. These include sweet, sour, bitter, and salty. Early in the 1900s, a sensory scientist in Japan, Professor Ikeda, described a fifth basic taste perception. He called it umami. In Japanese, this is a combination of the words umai, delicious, and mi, taste. The food industry operates under the scientifically based discipline of food science. It can take decades to verify a hypothesis, just as in medicine and pharmacology. In the ensuing years, umami has now been accepted as one of the five basic tastes, with receptors located on the tongue. The umami taste sensation is a little bit harder to describe than sour or salty. It's that savory, meaty, brothy flavor sensation. Research has shown that it's caused by a combination of the amino acid L-glutamate and 5' ribonucleotides. Glutamic acid alone does not provide the sensory effect. Rather, specialized taste receptors on the tongue identify the carboxylate anion of glutamate. Specifically, guanosine monophosphate and inosine monophosphate have been shown to amplify the taste intensity of glutamate, providing that meaty or brothy taste. These compounds are created naturally when steak is grilled or chicken is fried. The flavor industry takes these and other compounds and combines them to create savory flavors. Savory flavors are then added to soups, gravies, and other prepared foods to make them taste good.